Hello, welcome to LEGO Digital Designer, setting up for Mindstorms kit. All right, as you can see here, you've opened up LEGO Digital Designer. Hopefully you didn't get too bored while you were waiting for it to load. This is just gonna be a quick video on how to set it up so that we're um, limiting the pieces to the kits that you have um, available to you. Um, as you can see, there's LEGO Digital Designer, Digital Designer Extended, Mindstorms. So we're gonna click on the Mindstorms tab. And here we go, right here. And it may take a second or two. Please be patient. Okay, oh, as it goes back, let's go back here. And mine may lag a little bit there due to the recording. Okay, so as you can see here, we've got our Mindstorms kit. We're gonna limit it to just the Mindstorms pieces. So we're gonna come down here and we're going to go to free build. All right, now you have all of the NXT pieces and so on and so forth. I'm going to come down here to the left-hand corner, and we're going to filter bricks by boxes. And you want the Mindstorms EV3 for Education kit. So that's Mindstorms EV3 for Education. Click on that, and that will filter out the pieces that are not part of that kit. Okay, so you can see here, just a quick review, here are the tires and you see the little numbers those numbers tell you how many of each piece you have electronic parts and it may take a minute or two for the pieces to come up um, now you may find that you may have to go to some of the other kits for other pieces um, but this will get you started all right scrolling through you can see pretty much those are the pieces you have okay so again just a very quick video on how to set up for the Mindstorms, LEGO Mindstorms EV3 to limit the number of pieces you have. Okay, the next video will be on building and finding selected pieces.